Pet transport services are a popular way for people to move their dogs and cats across the country. But how do you know if your pets will be safe? The I team is finding that your precious cargo may not always make it home. We miss her and she doesn't deserve this. I know some people say, oh, it's just a dog, but it was our family member. When Karen Locascio moved to Chicago in May, she left her beloved Terrier Chihuahua mix Annabelle at home in Phoenix, Arizona, never expecting it would be the last time she'd see her. I was fearful of doing it anyway, but honestly, I felt like we didn't have a choice. Locascio was told by her airline that temperatures were too high for Annabelle to be transported in cargo and her dog was too tall for the cabin. So she found Citizen Shipper, an online marketplace that connects customers with independent third-party transport operators. One of those operators was to deliver Annabelle from Phoenix to Chicago. One day into the trip, Karen was told that Annabelle escaped. Why on earth would you leave my dog in the middle of the desert at night and then tell me the next day? Locascio filed a police report and searched tirelessly with the local Humane Society, but Annabelle has not been found. I just hope I want my cat back, you know? Yeah, I'm hopeful. Tajashri Diwali and her husband are devastated about what happened when they tried to ship their cats across the country. Back in March of 2020, they also used Citizen Shipper's website to book a third-party driver to take their two cats, Jack and Bean, from Virginia to San Jose, California. So I received this message saying, I delivered your cats. Despite receiving that message saying the cats were delivered, they were nowhere to be found. In fact, the Diwali say they were waiting there at the home where the cats were supposed to be delivered. Delivered. 43 days later, Jack was found in a residential area in Texas. Almost a year and a half later, Bean is still missing. The worst part is, uh, as you know, we as customers put our faith in Citizen Shipper. The couple says Citizen Shipper refunded them the initial booking fee and blocked the third party driver's account. Citizen Shipper says the company itself is not involved in the transport of any animals adding transporters are not employees of or subcontracted by citizen shipper. They are independent operators and that the customer is responsible for the selection and payment of the drivers. The company also says it performs standard background checks and we continually upgrade our vetting process, adding new verifications. It's terrible. She never leaves my side. She sleeps with me. Citizen Shipper refunded Lucascio's booking fee of $179 and she won a dispute through PayPal, getting $500 back from the third party transport company named Pup Protectors. Pup Protectors did not respond to multiple emails, texts, and calls from the I team. She doesn't deserve this because she did nothing wrong. Citizen Shipper's Better Business Bureau record has a B plus. However, it also responded to 32 now closed complaints in the last 12 months. Seven of those complaints involved missing or stolen pets or the treatment of pets. The company says that it has addressed all BBB complaints, adding that tens of thousands of pet owners use our platform annually to connect, vet, and hire independent contract pet transporters resulting in countless successful transports. It's like losing your own kid. Pets are like your kids. So we are, we are fortunate enough that we were able to recover one of our kids, but our second kid is still out there. When looking for a pet transport service, you should always dig deep, look beyond the first few hits online, research BBB reviews, and try to hire a company a friend or family member has had success using. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.